Uh, the storyline I would say this year is uh, definitely a little on the scary side. Um, we've got still have plenty of action, plenty of thrills, and plenty of comedy. Uh, but one of the nice things to be able to do in a third season is try new things out, like uh, flashback episodes or episodes that uh, play with time in a certain pulp fiction kind of way, which we do. Um, so I think you'll see us taking more chances, taking a little more risks, uh, and definitely uh, still bringing hopefully the same thrills and same uh, great drama that let's, the audience needs. Let's talk about all these flashbacks. So how far back can we expect these flashbacks to go and what will we see? Well, uh, announced uh, in the press was Ian Nelson, who is going to be playing Der young Derek Hale, and his age is around 15 um, at that time. So you'll be seeing him, and you'll be seeing a, a, a really cool story, I think. We were, we were really excited to come up with it. And it was, it was actually nice to be able to write a different, uh, a different side of Beacon Hills back then. So um, you're going to be seeing uh, a story that very much ties into the present story as well. And we, we learn a little bit more about him. So for the rest of season three, can we maybe expect to see some of these new characters get involved in some romance? I would say definitely yes, uh, especially our twins, played by Max and Charlie Carver, who are amazing. They come from Desperate Housewives, and they are two of the nicest guys, and they're such a good addition to the, to the show um, that uh, it, it's really nice to see the cast accept them as like, like they've been there the whole time. So we're going to have some fun with those characters.